I want to show you how to deal with brackets when we are writing math formulas in LibreOffice. Now, I'll first of all show you how to do the single bracket and then the normal bracket and then if you have a scalable bracket and also if you just need a single scalable bracket. So we start with the single uh, bracket. You just have to go to insert and then you go to objects and then you have formula. So when you get to the formula, if you want to have this, all you have to do is to write, use the backslash and then you write whichever brackets you want. If you want this or you want, I mean, two came, but you want only one. I was to, wanted to show you how to get the single bracket. So you just write uh, the, the backslash is the important thing. And then you write this and then you write um, the number you want, like six. And then maybe I would want to change the font so you can see it well. Well, you might ask, you can just write the brackets without putting the backslash and it works. Well, that is true, but if you don't want it like an italics and you want it as how you can see it now, then you need the uh, backslash. And then you go to um, format and you, I want to change the font so that you can see it well. So there. So here we are, we have, this is what we have created. Now the next one is just to get this normal bracket here. As, as I, in the same manner, you go to insert and then you go to objects and then you go to formula. Now you see these things here, you have unary, bi uh, binary operators, you have other options you can choose. You choose brackets because you need brackets. If you go to brackets and then if you need the brackets, this one, if you need this, you can choose this. It works, whatever I'm explaining works for curly brackets or all the other brackets. So you choose this and then the number you want, we add, you write the number in here. We have this. Now I want us to see because normally the font I have is 18. So you can also change the font size to, no, it's 12. So you can change it to, I'm changing it so that it's visible for you to see. So I change it to 32 and then there we have our 8 here. Now my next one is to show you how to do the scalable uh, bracket. So we have this, I'm going to show you how to do this. The same manner you go to insert, you go to object and then you go to formula and then you um, go to I think you go to format, yes. You can look through, but format is this. And then first of all, you have to write the number first before you put the brackets. You have to write the numbers you want before you put the brackets. So you click on this. You see here I have binom, and then you have the option to put your two numbers. So now I put my two numbers, five, and and eight for example and i also scale it for you to see so i go to format i change the font to 32 and then there you go so Oh, sorry, I've forgotten. We need the brackets. That's the main thing. So now we, wa we want to put the brackets. To put the brackets, you go to brackets. At, first of all, to, to get to the brackets, I would, you have to um, cut this. We cut it and let it remain there. So we, we've not pasted it yet. And then we go to brackets again. And now we choose this 
because this is what we want you understand why i cut it because i cut it i want to come and put it in here in, in um in here so that i can um I, I can put it in here to get the brackets so now i come here and then i what i cut i paste and then let's see now what happens i now have the brackets there now the next thing we want to do is to do the uh, scalable single bracket so in that same manner i go to insert i go to object and formula and then i first of all write the number so i go to format and then i choose the this one and then i put the numbers that i want to put in so i have um five and eight okay now i have five and eight you can see it's here also and then this in the same manner i cut it because i'm going to insert it into the formula of the uh, brace uh, of the bracket so i cut it i hold it for now and then i go to brackets and then i choose this now what i do is i put the number what i want to put in inside now what i cut i paste now and then you see here now i have to i want to i don't want my i want only a left brace or left bracket so the thing i have to do is to replace this with none so i go on and replace this with none the r brace with none and then that uh, maybe and then maybe let me scale it for you to see i go to format and i go to uh, font size and i change it again there you go so this is what we have now thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel for more videos bye